Today, I am going to showcase one of the unique applications of Spreadsheet Web in the investment and finance industry. Whether you are a stockbroker, portfolio analyst, or simply an individual investor, you need market data to make informed decisions. Many times, we bring that data into a spreadsheet. You may be maintaining your investment portfolio in a spreadsheet like most individual investors. Or you may be running a sophisticated Excel-based financial model for a major investment firm. One way or another, you need to bring that data into a spreadsheet fast and efficiently. Xignite is one of the major market data providers. In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how you can connect any Xignite data service to a spreadsheet file using Spreadsheet Web's Excel add-in. Let's first select the Xignite data service we'd like to connect to our spreadsheet. Let's say that we need the Get Research Field List method from the Xignite Analyst data service. This is the corresponding page from the Xignite web page. We need to know the request parameters of this method. According to this page, there are three parameters. Identifier, Identifier Type, and Analysis Group. Now I need to create three cells in my workbook corresponding to these parameters. Now I need to know the WSDL address for this web service. I can simply get that from the same page on the Xignite site under Code tab. This is all the information I need to start. Simply click on the Spreadsheet Web add-in, then select Insert Web Services. This will open a wizard prompt. Enter a friendly name, paste the WSDL address, enter your Xignite account username and password, and then press Next. Now the program connects to the Xignite server and requests the list of methods under this service. Select Get Research Field List from the list and press Next. Now it will get the input parameters from the system. As we expected, there are three parameters. Simply match them with the cells in the Excel file. Press Next. Now the program wants you to select a cell where the results from this service will be displayed. As you can see, the results of my web service call. I can change the stock symbol and run it again by pressing the Refresh Web Services button. Now, what if I wanted to share the spreadsheet with others, but I don't want them to see my file, nor do I want them to deal with Excel? I can simply publish this workbook to the Spreadsheet web server and give this link to my colleagues. Now they can access my application directly from any browser and run my model. This method can be applied to any Xignite data service. Thank you for attending this presentation. Please feel free to contact us for more information.